Angela and I want to welcome all of y'all to the rehearsal dinner. Thanks for everybody helping. Welcome everybody to this momentous occasion. I have to cry when I talk about my kids. It's just what I do. <laughs> so. When I was young, I always yearned, I always wanted a great partner. I had some good partners over the years, but I never had somebody that really just, you know, filled my cup. And uh, Patrick fills my cup. And uh, it's just, just amazing. Jen, you've grown up so much. Sorry. <laughs> I can't tell you how proud I am to call you one of my best friends. Jen comes home and she's like, Mom, I met this guy and I'm not paying attention. And she goes, I really think he's the one. So they go out that night and I'm sleeping on the couch. We meet Patrick and lo and behold, I mean, too good to be true. I was like, whoa, this guy is so out of your league. Like he is just the best. He was so nice. I hear the door open and I hear this guy saying to my daughter, sweet dreams. And I got the pillow over my head and started screaming. I was so mad. I'm like, oh my God, he is the one. Patrick told us he was gonna be 30 when he got married. He's 27 and a half. Jen came along, showed him how to dance, and the rest is history. Like she's a strong, beautiful, brilliant woman on her own walking beside and behind and in front of Patrick at times, they complete each other. God had a plan that you would come and join our family and I'd finally get a sister. You're my sister that I always wanted. <laughs> We're all here because we know how great Jennifer and Patrick are together. You know, I didn't think to say commitment, but this really rolls in well because uh, there's, there's another big commitment that's happening tomorrow and uh, you guys are maybe the greatest couple there is, okay? I know how much that uh, Jen's Mimi, my Marilyn, would like to be here tonight, and uh, she's here in spirit. What? What, Marilyn? Oh, shut up so they can drink? Okay. <laughs> above her door, she had a sign that said, live, laugh, love. And I think she had it above her door to, to really celebrate life and celebrate the successes of every day. And her mother and I are nothing but proud of the beautiful woman that she is, both inside and out, and we, we dearly love you. Patrick proposed on July 3rd, right before July 4th over the weekend. And uh, that 10 months that happened, uh, it's a blink of the eye. Uh, unbelievable how fast it has gone. I don't know that I've seen a prettier bride ever, but she's my daughter, what the hell. What do you want for your daughter? You want her to meet the man that is gonna be kind and loving and, and, and uh, gracious and all those things. And she met that man in Patrick. So if there's a tear, there's a tear of happiness. There's not a tear of sadness. I'm happy to give her up to Patrick. When you're running out of breath, I'll be the one to give you rest. I'll be here for you. Jen mandated two things on this wedding. One was I'll no creases in the tablecloths. I mean, that was a big deal. Don't ask me why, but I saw the lady ironing them earlier tonight. And I said, thank you for doing that because that was very important to her. And then the other thing was she mandates everybody to have fun tonight. Dearly beloved, we are gathered together here in the sight of God and in the presence of these witnesses to join together Patrick Mark Johnson and Jennifer Elaine Grant in Holy Matrimony. With this ring, this ring, I be wed, I be wed, in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. It's me great pleasure to introduce to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Patrick Johnson. Love, 
lovely, lovely ceremony we had to celebrate the wedding of Patrick and Jennifer. What a gorgeous couple. Give it up to Patrick and Jennifer. You know, life is precious, and you need to celebrate every moment of that life. And so uh, that's what we're here to do tonight, and thank you very much for being here. So if you have a glass, please raise it to Jennifer and Patrick. God bless.